Hello everyone, Chaos here, and welcome to another old school RuneScape video. Today, the Easy Desert Diary. For this set of tasks, you can expect to visit these locations. Feel free to pause if you would like to screenshot this map. For the level requirements, you need 5 Hunter and 21 Thieving. For the item requirements, you need 1000 coins, a Shanty Pass, Bird Snare, any pickaxe, 2 ropes, a knife, desert clothing, any grimy herb, any pyramid plunder artifact but stone items are easier to get, an empty water skin, food, anti-poison, and ranged gear, specifically weapon and ammo. For the quest requirements, you need partial completion of Ichlerin's Little Helper, and if I butcher that, oh well. Remember to bring some method of transportation to make this slightly faster. So, once you have everything ready, let's jump into the tasks. Alright, we are going to jump into the desert tasks, not before doing a little twist for good luck. And here at Shanty Pass, so task number one is going to be entering the desert with the desert shirt, robes and boots equipped, which is very easy. When we are in the desert, we will head west and we are going to enter the Calphite Hive. Now, the, for some reason the wiki says to bring two ropes and maybe this is just for backup, but you only need one to go to the main area where we are going to pick up some potato cactus. Um, if you want the second rope, that may be to go uh, with the Calphite Queen and at this level this is really not recommended. You can actually pick and drop the same potato cactus and that is going to be task complete if you do it five times. Now for the next one, as you can see here, use a knife with any cactus in the desert that is going to fill a, your water skin, whatever level it is at, except for full, obviously, and that is going to be task complete. We are then going to head to this little area east of the bridge, and as we catch a golden warbler, or however you pronounce it, that is also going to be task complete. This is not really recommended for a hunter, so this is pretty much the only time in which you will do this in your entire career. The, uh, for the next one, we are going to mine 5 clay northeast of where we were, and once we do that very, very easy task, go ahead and teleport or run all the way back to Shanty Pass, where we are going to travel to Polnivnich, if I am pronouncing that correctly, uh, with the magic carpet. Very, very easy task. And once we arrive here, we are going to go to Narda. Now, you could run, it's a very quick uh, run, and there's also a teleport scroll that you can get from Clue Scrolls, and that is going to be a very easy way. I recommend getting, a, I don't know, may, uh, maybe around 8, since we are going to be here in Narda for uh, many times in the future, and the future tasks. We are then going to go to the place where, which has the herb symbol and we are going to clean uh, a grimy herb. And once you do that, go in, uh, go southwest, no, uh, yeah, southwest, um, equip your ranging gear and kill one of these vultures that you can see flying around here. For some reason, some of them are standing in the ground and I am not sure if you can kill those or if they fly right away. For the next one, you want to bring any Pyramid Plunder artifact to this guy, go ahead and sell it, and that is going to be task complete. If you're an Iron Man, of course, you will obviously have to do Pyramid Plunder yourself, uh, but if you know, even if you do that, that is super easy. Uh, and for the final task, we are going to go to Pyramid Plunder, for, you know, in the first room, we're going to open the sarcophagus, which is in the middle of the room, and that is going to be the final task in the, uh, in the easy desert diary. I guess the outros are still something to uh, work on for these series, so hopefully you guys enjoyed, and let's go ahead and see what the rewards will give us. Once done, go to the NPC named Jar in Shanty Pass. You will obtain the Desert Amulet 1. You will also obtain a lamp worth a 2500 experience, and finally, all of these other benefits shown on screen. And that's pretty much it. If this video was useful in any way, make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more guides. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you soon.